What's going on guys? It's Troy Dan here. In today's video on NBA 2K16, we show you how to get a couple badges. Now, I wasn't going to make this video at first, but so many people have been asking me, Troy, 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 how to get limitless range? How to get Denai? Well, this video is for you. These two badges last year were some of the most important ones we had on the My Park. It seems like it's going to be about the same this year as well. Limitless Range. A player with Limitless Range can knock down very deep threes with a higher percentage than most. Now, very deep threes are not half-court shots, but having this badge here, you know, you don't have to be like hovering over the line. You can step back a little bit and expect it to probably go in. Now, Deadeye, this is also incredibly helpful. Now, a Deadeye shooter can knock down contested shots at a higher percentage than most. You don't want to be shooting contested shots anyway, but sometimes it happens. You know, sometimes we slip up. With this, it'll be a higher percentage to go in, so it's incredibly useful to have. All right, so the first badge we're going to show you how to get is Limitless Range. This is incredibly easy. All you have to do is be about here, shoot the three, and make it. Doesn't have to be green like that. Oh, we picked up a foul. That's all you have to do. So you just go over here. Uh, I'm on rookie, by the way. Make sure you got this on rookie. It makes it so much easier. That's the difficulty. Get out of the way, Randall. Right here. Take the shot. Hopefully it goes in. And it does. Do that 30 times. That's it. If you make that shot 30 times, you will get limitless range. It's the easiest badge to get. So we just go right here. I, the man's not on me. I'll take the shot. It'll go in. That counts towards limitless range. There it is. You even see the badge activated in the top right. So the next badge I'm going to show you is how to get Deadeye. Now, this one's a little more difficult than limitless range, so pay attention. What you're going to want to do is about uh, be about here, and then you want to put his hand in your face as he's doing. Once he's done that, you can take the shot. Hopefully it goes in. It has to go in, which it did right there, and that's it. When he jumps in the air to swat it as he did, that counts towards as a contested shot. Only that animation. If you do that a hundred times and make it, you'll get Deadeye. So again, you're going to want to walk in here, get the man on you. You don't want to double team. Put your hand in my face. Put your hand in my face. Sometimes you got to step back. There he is. Hand in my face. Shoot it. He jumps. It goes in. That's it. Just make sure you're in that mid-range spot. You don't have to be shooting threes uh, with Deadeye. It just makes it more complicated. And make sure to put it on Rookie. In the past, you would have put it on Hall of Fame because it was easier. But this way, with the changes in defense, they're more in your face now. So you can just leave it on Rookie. You don't have to put it any higher. So just push up here. Get him. There's the hand in the face. Take the shot. And it missed. Can't make them all. Just walk in here. Wait for him to put the hand. Oh, no, no. Not, not like that. There it is. Put the hand in my face. There's the hand. Take the shot. And that's it. Even got a double move. Oh, I'm handy out here. We'll just push in here. Wait for him to put the hand in my face. Get on me. There's the hand. Take the shot. He jumps. Got a green on that as well. Again, it's key for them to jump. That's what activates the badge. So, folks, that's how you get Deadeye and Limitless Range. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments below. Or if you want me to go over another badge, we can do that as well. Thank you for watching. And as always, keep your stick on the ice.